Elsewhere in Summer Bay, Rue receives a very tempting offer after hearing from nephew Ryder. Former salt barman Ryder left the bay just over two years ago, after the glamour of the illicit poker nights being held at the restaurant saw him embark on a whole new career path. To become a, legit, casino croupier, Ryder got in touch with Mum Quinn, Lara Cox, who works as a singer on international cruise ships. She was soon able to forward him a job advert for a mixologist on a massive new liner, the Pearl of the Sea, which would open up the opportunity to move around the ship and train up as a croupier, with the added bonus that he'd get to see the world at the same time. When Ryder's application was successful, the only catch with the dream opportunity was the fact that he would have to leave Summer Bay the very next day. From all accounts since, Ryder has excelled in his new career path, and next week when he contacts Rue, he explains that he's been given a promotion. One of the perks of the new position is that he will be able to bring someone with him on the next cruise, and he invites Rue to join him. Having recently begun the application process to become a foster carer, Rue isn't sure the time is right to be sailing off around the world, but John, Shane Withington, quite rightly points out that the application could still take several months. It seems Ryder is determined that his aunt should take a break however, and so recruits Marilyn in an attempt to convince her to say yes. Despite the peer pressure, Rue is still wavering, it's very short notice and Alf, Raymar, is also away visiting Martha, Belinda Giblin, at the moment. Plus she'd be literally gone for months. However, Marilyn is sure that Alf would support her if she were to take the plunge. Rue isn't sure that she has her sea legs anymore. Despite Marilyn pointing out that she grew up on the Blacksland, ahem. We won't mention the continuity error there in that Alf didn't purchase the boat until 2001. However, having slept on it, the next morning Rue heads to the coffee cart and orders a double shot, revealing to Marilyn, Leah and John that she needs to pack extra quick as she has a ship to catch. Rue tells them that Alf was all for it, and the foster agency are also aware. Though she does point out that it means leaving the surf club in John's capable hands. With that, the group bid Rue a quick bon voyage as she heads off on her latest adventure. Rue's departure will mark the beginning of a lengthy on-screen break for the character.